Good afternoon. It is Wednesday and we're starting to see our clouds clearing out. Mostly clear skies for Tucson overnight with a low of 55 degrees. That still puts us close to 10 degrees above normal for our overnight reading. And then for our Thursday, warming to 88 by the afternoon. Mostly sunny, maybe a few high level clouds, but our clouds won't do much to cool us off. We'll still be at 15 degrees above average as tomorrow our average temperature drops to 73 for this time of year. Across the rest of southern Arizona, 69 in Sholo, 80 for Wilcox and Bowie, 84 though for Tombstone, Sierra Vista, 83, 85 Nogales, 87 in Marana. 88 Ajo, 88 Cells, 84 in Three Points, but 88 Tucson, 89 Sarita, and 84 in Oro Valley. Looking ahead to Saturday, still going to be the coolest day of the next seven with an afternoon high of 78, but when you're starting the race, 53 degrees, mostly sunny, wind from the east-southeast up to 10 miles per hour. Around the middle of the race, or perhaps when you're crossing the Santa Cruz River, 77, mostly sunny, some high level clouds, again, easterly winds up to 10 miles per hour, and then when you're finishing up, around 5 o'clock or so, 76, mostly sunny, and north northeasterly winds at that time, 5 to 10 miles per hour. Look at the extended keg of night in your side, 7 day, we are looking at clear skies across the board. As our high pressure starts to weaken a touch, thanks to a storm system passing through to our north, our temperatures will drop from that 88 degrees tomorrow, 84 Friday, 78 Saturday, back to 79 Sunday and Monday, and then near 80 for our Tuesday and Wednesday, heading into our Thanksgiving. Notice those overnight lows dropping to the upper 40s as well, Sunday night into Monday morning and Monday night into Tuesday morning. Hopefully you'll join us tomorrow for Thanksgiving on the Mayflower. We are taking food and monetary donations for the Community Food Bank of Southern Arizona. And that is going to be at the Sam's Club at River and Stone. I'll be live there at 5 and 6 o'clock, but we've got folks from Kega 9 on your side who will be there all day long. And if you haven't yet, follow me on Facebook. Look for Aaron Christensen Kagan with Kagan in all caps, and you'll see that blue circle there with a the check mark. That way you know you have found the verified station page, and you can stay up to date on everything that I am following. And watch us tonight for Kagan Night on Your Side at 5, 6, and 10, and on KWBA, that's at 9 p.m. I'll see you for all four of those newscasts. Have a great Wednesday.